Hey, what's up, guys? It's Mike again. All right, um, I want to do another quick video for you guys today about, uh, I guess you could call it coming up with a side hustle. All right, so there's a lot of people out there that live in paycheck to paycheck, you know, having a hard time paying their bills, uh, making the ends meet, you know, um, and it's because they were taught a certain way of life, right? You know, go to school, get a job, you know, or go to college, get a degree, get a good job. All that crap that we were told growing up that would lead to our happiness. Except they didn't, you know, the people who were telling us that didn't quite prepare us for the things that were going to come at us as adults, right? The amount of bills and stuff and how to make a budget, how to uh, balance your checkbooks and stuff like that, right? And so we got so concentrated on just getting a job that we didn't um, we didn't figure out how to do the budgeting side of things right so this quick little video is for those people that are are living that way which is the majority of us especially here in america um for the guys out there you know your job your first job as a man is to be able to take care of yourself and if you decide you want a family and whatnot later on in life it's going to be your responsibility to take care of that family all right so one of the ways that we can help financially you know because I, I always talk about you know as a man your energy your health and your wealth well the wealth side of things is you know being able to pay for the things we need in this life uh, yeah, you can go out and somehow acquire some land or whatever and try to live off of the land or whatever, but you're still going to need tools. You're still going to have to barter and trade with, with people, um, whether it's money or goods or whatever, right? Um, so anyway, this is for people that are living in modern times, trying to survive in America. We're all good at something, right? And we should take that something or, or one of those other things that we were good at and get yourself a little side hustle right you can walk out of your door and come out with ideas of different ways that you can make money on the side besides your normal nine to five job or, or whatever your security guard you know what I'm saying you work nights and that's the only way you got money coming in but we all know security guards don't make that much unless you're working for some really high-end company or something all right so um, you know just some quick some quick things. There's plenty of places to find ideas for side hustles. You can go on YouTube, uh, not YouTube, well, yeah, YouTube. Well, YouTube's full of ideas. You know, how to. Just type in how to into YouTube and you'll come up with a whole bunch of stuff. Right? Um, you get on your social media, like the Facebook and Instagram, you see these little commercials that pop up. And one of the ones that comes to my mind right off the bat is, uh, oh boy, what's his name? Gary V. Okay, I always see little commercials for Gary V. This guy is full of good information and ideas all right whether you agree with the way he talks about lifestyle whether you agree or not the guy has a whole bunch of ideas so right off the top shout out to Gary Vee I'm not trying to steal your information I'm, I'm just passing along the information that that's in your ads all right you two don't chop me down because I said Gary Vee all right um, anyway one of the things that I heard on one of his commercials is that you can go to the dollar store, you can go to garage sales, um, go to Target, you know, whatever, all those stores and stuff. Buy the things that are on sale. Go home. If you're seeing this video, that means you have some way to get on the internet. Get on eBay, get on Craigslist, and you can resell the stuff that you bought for cheap. You know, um, I saw uh, one dude, um, I he put out this idea I'm just gonna say I'll say in fact I don't want to steal nobody's idea so this guy Chris Johnson okay he sells watches he's got his own watch company you know he's very uh, lucrative he's, he's doing good with his business really good right but he said uh, one of his old side hustles was he would go to Ross and buy a watch for $35 or whatever right go home sell it online for you know double the price or whatever just put it out there Somebody somewhere doesn't have a Ross nearby where they can go buy that watch, but if they see it and they like it, they'll pay the price. 
right? Because that's the only place that they're able to get it. And so you can make a quick, quick come up, you know, 25, 30 bucks on a watch. And the good thing about Ross, right? Look, I'm giving shout outs to everybody today. Good thing about Ross is most of their stuff, you can buy it and they have a return policy. If you don't sell it, you can return it to Ross and get your money back. No loss. You know what I'm saying? Like that's that's a very low risk way of making some extra money. Alright. So you know that that's just that's one side hustle. Alright. Buy stuff cheap and sell it. Alright, um hold on I got a message here. Okay, I got a haircut to go do. All right, so um, that's one side hustle. So, like I said, you can walk out your door and see all kinds of uh, things that need to be done. Um, all you can get ideas for for other side hustles, right? So, look at all your neighbors' yards, man. Landscaping, you know, um, especially if you live like I live in a community. I live in the oldest part of this area of Tucson that I live in, right? So there's a lot of older people that own the homes out here, you know, so you can go knock door to door and whatnot and offer them lower prices to do their landscaping than what they're already paying. You know, that's a side hustle. That's all you can do on the weekends. Make some extra money. You can get your bills paid on the weekend doing landscaping. Do two or three yards in a day. You know, that's that could cover your electric, water, and gas. Okay? So it's just under... Or maybe your car payment. You want that brand new truck? Hey, you know what? It might only take one or two weekends to get the payment together for that truck. You haven't even touched your regular paycheck. All right. So that's one. Um, uh, another one. I have a friend um, that works in the medical field. You know, but as a side job, a little side hustle, he has a trailer, and he advertises that he'll haul stuff to the junkyard. And people are buying stuff all the time. That's how, you know, these Sam Levitts and furniture places and all that, you know, they, that's how they stay making money because people are always buying stuff. So advertise that you'll take their old stuff out for them. You know, take it and haul it to the junkyard for them. Charge a flat rate fee, you know, at age. 20 bucks, I'll come get your stuff, take it to the junkyard. You take it to the junkyard, they pay you for the metal and all that. And man, you're making money on both ends. All right. That's just... I mean, there's so many ways you can get online and do how-to classes. Do you know teach classes on how to do this and how to do that? Um, you know, people that are streaming online. You know, it, it, there's so many things that you can do, but you have to start thinking. All right, get out of that mindset of the only way to make money is to go and work and trade hours for dollars. There's a whole bunch of ways to make money. Okay, so. Uh, I just want to put it out there, man. This is this is some of those red pill truths that you hear about. All right, we were all taught a specific way to live life, and that's to go be a laborer for someone else. Someone else owns a company, and they will pay you to do a job for them. Well, what's wrong with starting your own company? We all got to start somewhere, right? You start small, and you can grow. Imagine you get all the the houses in your neighborhood. If you get landscaping gigs with them, you know, and they're going to spread the word, they're going to tell their nieces and nephews and cousins and friends, right? They're going to tell everybody they know who does your, who does their yard because they're so proud of the work you do, all right? But you got to get out there and do it, um, you know, get you, uh, learn how to fix things that you have in your house, the dishwasher, the uh, washer and dryer, you know what I'm saying, blenders, whatever it is, if you know how to fix those things, do a little side side hustle man get, get yourself out there um, and start something okay but like I said in one of my other videos there's consequences to inactions okay if you do nothing you get nothing all right if you're having a hard time paying your bills there's ways to make money on the side you're not stuck with your nine to five get out there all right take risks and make something of yourself okay but the only way to do it is to get out there and do it all right so that's my little side side hustle spiel for the day. Um, I'll get back with you guys on the next one. Please like and subscribe. Tell your friends about it. Share it. There's a link right down there, I believe.
um, I think you can hit the share button and you'll see um, you can copy the link and you can post it in your social media for me alright that's just me uh, asking for you to show that you like what you hear if you don't like what you hear leave a comment below so I can know what I can do better alright all right, until next time guys aloha it's Mike Shinery I'm out